My White Best Friend North and Other Letters Left Unsaid is a curation of letters written by writers of colour to the people that most need to, to hear them. So we've got an amazing cohort of writers that we've commissioned to write letters um, for, for our version of My White Best Friend North. So we have letters uh, from Keith Saha, Brody Arthur, Kiara Mohammed Amin, Yasmin Ali, Chantel Lunt, uh, Dominique Walker, and Levi Tafari. So writers that uh, have like a real breadth of experiences and um, knowledge and things to say. So when you're coming to see it, you're in the hands of some really amazing writers that are, are gonna take you on a really brilliant journey for the night. The actors haven't seen uh, any of the letters, so they'll be reading them for the first time live on the night. It levels it a bit for us, so we're all hearing these words for the first time together. And that's what this project wants to do. This project wants to spark some of that conversation. It wants to give voices to those people that feel like there's something really important to say, but also for us to experience that together as one, as a collective in that space for the first time. We've got like a really, a really amazing cast of local actors that are gonna be performing in My White Best Friend North. Some uh, people that you'll know really, really well. Uh, uh, and that's also part of the hook to get you to come to both nights because you won't know which night they'll be performing on. It feels like those letters are in really safe hands and it feels like we're going to get really amazing performances even though they'll be reading it for the first time on the night. This project being a collaboration between us, the Royal Exchange and Eclipse, it shows that there's real importance in sharing and platforming those voices from writers of colour across the north. Actually understanding that there's different experiences from people all over the country that we're able to share uh, when we do it together. So across the partners, we've commissioned 19 writers to tell 19 uh, unique stories in these 19 letters. Uh, and that just feels like a drop in the ocean, really, of some of the voices that we haven't heard so far from uh, writers of colour in the north of England. So it feels really exciting that we're getting to start that process and hopefully introduce our audiences to lots of brilliant writers that maybe they haven't had the, the pleasure of experiencing yet. So I think I feel really privileged to be a part of this project and to be a part of bringing um, these amazing letters to life. I feel really proud of that. I also just really feel like this is exactly what we should be doing. It just feels right. It feels like um, this is what we should be doing right now on these stages. It feels like telling these stories and hearing these voices from Liverpool is the right thing to be doing on our stages right now. Liverpool has really rich communities from all over the globe that have settled here in Liverpool. So it feels really important. And I feel really proud that we get to share some of those stories and voices on the stage here.